students at one college are demanding more action be done to stop a potential spike. That's right. They claim students who tested positive still came to class and staff is not helping with contact tracing. 12 News' Alex Love joins us in studio after speaking with some of those students over concerns about what's going on. Alex? So the students I spoke to attend the medical assistant program at Delta Technical College. Basically, the students say that they find themselves navigating between getting an education while keeping themselves, their classmates, and families healthy. Group chat messages obtained by 12 News show in the daytime Delta Technical Medical Assistant class, at least four students as of Thursday tested positive for the coronavirus after attending class all week. Asia Crockett, who's nine months pregnant, became the fifth Friday. Our teacher instructor has been around us, and she's still on campus. The uh, lab teacher, he's been around us. She's still on the campus. The whole school is still going on without being notified. People positive on the campus. Trying to get answers, she went to her course instructor, but other than getting tips on how to get tested, hit a dead end. Crockett says the instructor claimed this problem only started 24 hours earlier, even though group chats allege infections reached three students before Thursday. I can't tell y'all until HR gives me what to do. So I've been on it since this morning, and email is getting ready to go out, like literally right now. We have an HR department, and all that has to register through them before we come out. Ms. McCarthy told her that it was three or four other people before her that tested positive. So if it was three other people before her, there was well over 24 hours of her knowing that and still had us coming in the classroom knowing that the coronavirus was around. That's not information that you hide. And I'm taking it serious because I'm pregnant. And I woke up this morning feeling sick. For other students to know if they're at risk, they claim their only way is by word of mouth between the fourth classmate who tested positive. She was like the teacher knew and they still allowed her to come to school. When I first heard about it on Friday, she told them on Thursday she was in class with my name from Thursday in person. Since others tested positive, the medical assistant program did switch online for this week. But in emails obtained by 12 News may still need to come in. After instructors informed everyone, they must pick up law and ethic books Wednesday and go through on lab schedules required to attend on site. They don't care about our well-being. The only thing they're thinking about is money. For students positive with COVID-19 while pregnant like Asia or those negative like Chris, it became a decision of passing or keeping their families healthy. And we have reached out to Delta Technical College for any explanation on their plans of preventing the coronavirus spikes on campus. But as of now, we have not heard back.